Hey guys, and I have to tell you, it's probably too late to panic. The shortages are already here even more. They're not getting any less. They're not getting any better. So, yeah, it's too late to panic now. So, almost too late. So, nobody's gonna help you if you don't help yourself. Today, I had to, I had to go to Walmart and I saw some even worse shortages than before. I mean, the meat was better, but pretty much everything else was worse. And I'm gonna show you some in this video later. So all these shortages are getting blamed on shortage of workers. But, okay, think, if they would suddenly have twice more workers than they do now, would they have like twice more stuff than they do now? Um, I don't think so. I mean, there's somebody, there's still, um, need to be some ingredients to produce that stuff, not just people to make it and, uh, you know, people to put it on shelves. And also, do they really want to have more workers? Because they gotta pay more if they have more workers. Uh, because I personally know a few people who are looking for a job and they've been uh, uh, applying to many different places, like maybe 20 or more, and nobody's calling them back or hiring them. And also, even if they get one or two interviews, after that they're still like not hiring them. So I don't know what's going on. They all complain that using the excuse that the shortage of workers, but it might be just an excuse. It might be. We don't know. <laughs> Hopefully we'll find out someday, but we don't know. Also, um, the empty shelves. Now it's on the news that the shelves are empty. And they're saying it's going to be for... for uh, I, I watched the news thingy on the... I think it was Fox 5 or something on YouTube that they were saying that um, empty shelves are expect expected to be here for a, for a few months. Um, I think they're saying a few months just to so people not worry too much and not panic. But because they don't want people to panic, right? Same thing like they were saying about the inflation, like it's uh, uh, like temporarily inf inflation right but really now they're saying it's here to stay so what if they after a couple months they're, they're gonna say the shortages are here to stay because that's what they did what they're saying about inflation i mean it's just whatever they say in the news um they're saying whatever they have to to probably calm down the people so they don't like panic and go crazy so don't don't believe them go crazy already i mean not too crazy but be aware you know so there was a saying somebody said that i don't remember who um they said something who controls the food controls the people and who controls the energy controls the whole continent well apparently somebody wants to control the people and the whole continent because we have food crisis the uh and the shortages and everything. And then we have energy crisis at the same time. And also uh, all the other essential shortages that go with it too. So somebody out there apparently wants to control the world. <laughs> well, it's not a secret for anybody, but it's, it's becoming very obvious right now. So be prepared guys and not scared and don't trust everything they say on the news and other media because a lot of things they're saying is just well they they're kind of true but it's just so you stay home watch tv eat some frozen prepared food and not worry about anything but we all know that it is our own responsibility to take care of us because if something all of a sudden happens that there's nothing in the stores uh nobody's gonna help us I mean, the government is not going to be able to help everybody, even if they would want to do that, but if they want to do that, but I don't know if they would, but they just wouldn't be able to physically feed everybody because where are they going to get the stuff if there's nothing in the store? They don't have like storages somewhere, at least I don't, I'm not aware of them. If you are, let everybody know, please. <laughs> so yeah, so um, I'm going to show you some videos I took at the store today some clips of the empty shelves so you see what's missing the um pasta is missing a lot so watch that
and they found this card here apparently somebody's stocking up 